Our next one is prioritization and holding space. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to priority, no matter what's happening in our life, because here's the thing, we love this quote that says, life is like the ocean. There's always gonna be waves. The good news is, is that you can learn how to surf. Mm -hmm. And so hopefully we're giving you metaphorical surfboards mm -hmm. to be able to ride the inevitable waves, right? We're in a state of the union. There's a lot of stuff happening. That's a big wave. There's gonna be another wave in three years, in a year, in 10 years, right? How do we ebb and flow with that? Mm -hmm. And no matter what's happening, we have chosen to prioritize our love and connection. Because when you hear about all the thought leaders out there that they've interviewed everyone on their deathbed and they hear about what they cared about, they don't, they don't like say, oh, I wish I would have worked so much more and I wish I would have taken the calls. No, they wish they would have spent more loving, living, mattering, spending time with their friends and family. Mm -hmm. So we know that those are all the regrets of mm -hmm. people on their deathbed. We don't want that. Mm -hmm. So we choose to like, no matter what's happening, even if we don't want to, oh, babe, I'm too stressed. I can't do it. Oh, we're having all this kind of fights or yeah. whatever. <sighs> we prioritize like, oh, one of us may say, hey, babe, just hold each other. And mm -hmm. sometimes we'll just hold each other. And sometimes we'll, we'll dance for a second. Mm -hmm. Or maybe we'll just look at each other in each other's eyes, left eye to left eye. Or maybe we'll breathe together for, you know, yeah. 10 seconds. Or we'll but just we reset. Be, yeah, like even in a stressful situation, right? I might just randomly turn on the music and start dancing around. Like it's, it's really about like in, in previous relationships, I would have prioritized work over the relationship, right? I was prioritizing other things over the relationship. And it always led to the other person not feeling safe, seen, heard, or loved. Mm -hmm. And so it's really checking in with yourself. Like, am I really prioritizing what matters most? Because like yeah. Emilio said, jobs come and go, money comes and goes, everything else comes and goes, but mm -hmm. like your relationships are really mm -hmm. the things that, you know, the quality of your life creates the quality of your relationship. And if you're not prioritizing your relationships, then they are not going to be quality ones. And we see life, just like a video game. Like mm -hmm. every day, we start a new day, it's a new level. Yeah. How can we show up today fully? Because yeah. we know that life is fragile. I'm sure that you guys have seen that in the past year and a half. Mm -hmm. Life is fragile. We know that, you've probably heard that, but we choose and practice to live that every single day. We look at each other and we think about death often and say, hey, look, how can we live today fully and prioritize the journey, mm -hmm. right? There is no there. Yep. You're like, oh, when I make a lot of money, this is gonna happen. I, when we get to this house, babe, this is gonna happen. Yeah. When we get to this other place, this, no, it is not. <laughs> it's not. No, it is not. It's then when you not. get there, you're gonna want something else and yep. you're chasing a freaking carrot. There's always gonna be something more, right? And yeah. if you don't ever learn how to find happiness and joy and peace in the moment, then we're completely missing out mm -hmm. on on the on the actual life experience this amazing gift we've been given yeah um so, so yeah prioritizing and holding space for each other right like mm -hmm. holding space for if he's if either one of us is going through a hard time right like say i lost a job or you know something stressful happened at work or dealing with some sort of like insecurity or healing a past trauma mm -hmm. that we both know how to hold space for mm -hmm. the other person so that you know sometimes if he's going through something super hard like i might have to like be the strong one and be there for him and mm -hmm. vice versa yeah. and so i think it's right like regardless of what's going on in your life in your world at work with family with friends it's really understanding like what really matters to you and are you choosing it yeah. or are you choosing something else because you're always choosing and if you want like people are chasing money or a better career to like get this or get that like what I had to flip on its head is that when I take care of this, everything else falls into place. Mm -hmm. Everything else flourishes. Everything else becomes 10X. Mm -hmm. But sometimes people are so rigid focused over here. When you take care of this, oh my gosh, guys, it's a different level. Like mm -hmm. I can feel so, like there's a foundation for me to lift off yeah. rather than having to like just go back and forth, right? So take care of this, everything will fall into place.